brain tech, yeah? Web tech is made simple. So as I posted on just over a month ago, Windows 11 version 22H2, which is this year's feature update for Windows 11, was getting closer to its public release. And that's because Microsoft had rolled out version 22H2 build 22621 to the release preview channel on the 7th of June last month. And um, this is where it's going to under the feature update is going to undergo its final testing until um, its official release we are expecting to see roll out in October later this year. Now, as many of you are also aware, earlier this week, um, Microsoft started rolling out their July Patch Tuesday uh, cumulative security updates for both Windows 10 and 11. And for Windows 11, that was KB5015814. And over and above... Um, the stable channel for Windows 11 getting the Patch Tuesday security updates. Microsoft has also started rolling out um, Patch Tuesday security updates to uh, the release preview channel for Windows 11 version 22H2 and that's with update KB5015818 and that will take the build um, in the release preview channel from build 22621 to 22621.232 after applying the update. Now at this stage, there's not too much to show you and there's not too much information regarding the update because for some strange reason, Microsoft has not made available and posted the uh, release notes for the update KB5015818. But um, according to reports, uh, it will contain most of the security fixes that did roll out uh, to, to and with the stable channel update. And um, as mentioned, there are no release notes but um, the reports are saying that um, the File Explorer tabs and Navigation Pane, which are two new features rolling out and, and, and are expected to be rolling out with Windows 11 version 22H2 later this year, have now been enabled by default for uh, insiders who have um, applied the latest update, KB5015818. So um, as I mentioned, no release notes, but I like to keep you informed on this channel and just wanted to let you know that... Um, that the uh, version 22H2 feature update currently being tested in the release preview channel now has been bumped up to build 2261.232 and has, a, has received a security cumulative update for the month of July, KB5015818. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.